Can you solve one of the medium level dynamic programming question that appears at every single company? So given a string s, return the length of the longest palindromic subsequence inside the string. Now a palindrome is a string that can be read the same way forwards and backwards. Let's say we're given this string, we have the following subsequence that can form the longest palindrome, so we can return its length 7. Let's go over the dot process. Inside a palindrome, we can see that we have pairs of same characters. We can implement a two-pointer approach, one pointer on each side. Now, if the characters at the pointers are the same, we can increment the palindrome length by 2 and move the pointers toward the center. If the characters at the pointers are not the same, we will have two choices. We can either skip the character on the left side or skip the character on the right side. We will pick the choice that will give us the longer palindrome. And lastly, if the pointers are at the same character, we can increment the palindrome length by 1 by placing the character at the center of the palindrome. Let's implement the function longest palindrome subsequence taking the input string, return the result of the helper method. Now let's implement the helper method taking in the two pointers and the input string. If there are no characters, return 0. If the pointers are the same, return 1. If the characters are the same, return the result of moving both pointers toward the center plus 2. Else return the larger value between skipping the left side or skipping the right side. 